it's a Sunday and we are going to Legoland, Germany. Uh, it's about like a five hour drive from Prague uh, and uh, today is just a travel day. Uh, we are staying uh, off-site in uh, Leipheim. Uh, we are thinking that when we arrive we will maybe go to Legoland village and uh, because there are some playgrounds there and check it out if we are able to get in there I'm not sure if you like don't have uh, the accommodation or the tickets for the day if you are able to enter the village or not but we will uh, find out I guess um, yeah, and from tomorrow uh, we are going to uh, directly to Legoland. Uh, the hotel we are staying at is about like eight kilometers away from it, and then we will be staying on site for uh, two nights, and we will stay or spend uh, two days uh, in the parks. And in uh, Legoland, uh, Germany, you have uh, several types of accommodations. Uh, the cheapest um, are uh, the camping barrels, but that's just, um, you have only the beds in there and the bathrooms are like public uh, for the people who are staying in the barrels. And then you have cottages. Uh, we are staying in a cottage. Uh, the cottage consists of like uh, two rooms for like two families and the, the cottages are themed. Um, there is a pirate adventure, the, like uh, cars and the Egyptian theme. And if you want to like pick one, you can uh, pay some extra. Uh, but uh, we uh, did not pay extra and it's gonna be a surprise uh, the theme of the cottage and the cottages are really uh, nice we stayed uh, there before uh, they have like uh, two rooms like the main uh, room and also the kids room uh, with a bunk bed so it's very very cool option for the families I'm gonna of course um, show you how it looks in there and then you have, of course, the hotels, and they have a, a, like a knights-themed uh, hotel, and then a pirates-themed hotel. Uh, the hotels are um, a bit more expensive than the cottage, but as I said, like we've uh, stayed before at the cottage, and we were really uh, satisfied uh, there. So I'm gonna show you, and uh, you'll see. I don't think. Uh, know there are any like perks uh, to staying at a, a Delago uh, hotel and uh, all, all the types of accommodations are in the um, holiday village uh, where you also have some restaurants um, and uh, you have several uh, playgrounds uh, for the kids so that's why I'm, I said that we I uh, want to go and uh, try to check out the playgrounds uh, and then uh, we will be going to the parks uh, on Monday and on Tuesday and then Wednesday uh, will be again uh, the travel day um, so the breakfast is included in our stay so I'm going to show you the breakfast and also we've paid for um, dinner uh, in the buffet restaurant so show you that uh, also so we're looking forward to it the weather is a bit like a question uh, what it's gonna be like because the forecast again like is changing quite frequently so far it looks that it's not gonna be perfect uh, that it's gonna rain both on Monday and Tuesday but you know it can change still so uh, we'll see about that and on Monday if it's not raining, uh, they are going to have a Lego parade, uh, which I'm really looking forward to. They don't have a parade every day. You have to check their calendar to see uh, what days uh, the parade are. Usually it's uh, the weekend, uh, the first uh, of May. Um, 
I don't know if it's it's um, it's like a holiday in the Czech Republic. I don't know if it's a day off in uh, Germany, but um, I'm guessing like a lot of Czechs uh, will be traveling uh, for like a, a weekend or prolonged uh, weekend getaway. Uh, so yes, yeah, so so they're supposed to be a parade on uh, Monday. And I'm really hoping to see it because I've uh, already watched uh, some videos uh, on YouTube and uh, it looks uh, pretty nice. So, so I hope that it doesn't really rain and, and we can uh, see that. Uh, so yeah, I mean, we're really looking forward to it. Um, I really like Legoland Germany. We've been there several times uh, before we had our kids. Now my son is uh, big enough to ride most of the rides, except for like the big uh, roller coasters. Uh, but the rest he can ride. Ella uh, cannot ride a lot of rides there. So if you just have um, one kid or like uh, it's under two years uh, of age, I would not recommend to go into Legoland because they have uh, like in comparison to Disney they have quite a lot of height restrictions and you cannot ride on many rides with really small children so check that out they have uh, the list of attractions and the height restrictions on their website so before you take a baby there uh, really check it out because you might uh, be disappointed um, yep, so yeah, and they have uh, a new land, uh, Lego Mythica, and there's a new roller coaster, um, and some other new rides. So, uh, so I'm really excited uh, to check that out, and uh, I am also like interested in what, what kind of merch they have because, um, when we were there previously they don't cater much to the adults there is not a lot of souvenirs for adults uh, it's very like kid oriented but I think there are like so many uh, Lego uh, fans uh, who are like adults that they should really like change uh, their strategy a little bit and add some more uh, merch so we'll see if, if they did or they didn't I have no idea uh, there is also like a factory store where you can buy uh, separate uh, bricks and there is like a outlet where you can uh, also buy separate like Duplo uh, bricks so I'm looking forward to that I'm gonna ch I, I want to check some uh, Duplo out and some regular um, Lego because we are missing some uh, parts uh, for our Lego sets um, so I'm gonna check that out also so there is like a lot to look uh, forward to we are also uh, traveling with our friends uh, you saw them at uh, Frightside Barn Blonde uh, they are also traveling today but they are gonna stay a little bit uh, further uh, from Legoland on the first day because they have uh, the you know are we there yet kind of kids and they want to just uh, split uh, the trip a little bit uh, we want to do it all in one go um, and yeah so we will meet uh, tomorrow and I am hoping for loads and loads of uh, fun so I will see you uh, when we get there and uh, I will show you the hotel that we are staying in and then we'll check uh, out uh, the, the village, hopefully. So we, we arrived at the first hotel. Uh, you have like, if uh, you are more than two people, you have to book uh, multiple rooms. Uh, so we have two rooms because there's four of us. So here's the hotel. They have a full length uh, mirror. They have like a kitchenette. Let's see, with some appliances, which is nice. Uh, the room has a desk, 
a big fridge, uh, a big uh, window with a view of a field and then you have uh, quite a big um, bed and a bathroom. The room was quite cheap and I feel like it is quite sufficient. So, so far it's nice. So we arrived in Leibheim and now, as I said before, we went uh, to uh, the Legoland Holiday Village and um, there is no uh, checks uh, to uh, come in here. So we'll spend uh, the weekend here because uh, there is um, in the back, there is a pirate uh, hotel and there is a big uh, playground for kids. So. We're going to check it out and uh, let uh, Ferda run for a bit. Maybe there is also something suitable for small kids and Ella can also enjoy. Here are, uh, I think uh, this is called the Ninjago quarters. And this is new, so I think this is something like in between uh, the cottages and uh, the hotel and in front of us is the uh, pirate island hotel and as i said they have a huge uh, playground there uh, for the kids so uh, we're gonna check it out i don't remember where the rest of the cottages uh, are uh, but we will uh, figure it out uh, tomorrow and uh, uh, we'll see which theme we get but uh, this is uh, really looking uh, very nice and yeah we are starting the vacation but hop back bar. let's go and there's a pirate ship so we are done uh, for today we just uh, had a short break after the long drive at the playground it uh, looked really nice and uh, there is a big pirate ship with uh, some slides and uh, things to run around and we are going to head back to the hotel and and yeah have something to eat and look forward for tomorrow when the vacation will officially start so good night for today and see you tomorrow so i'm back and uh we were uh, walking around for a bit and I figure out, uh, figured out where the cottages are there in the back you can see the Egyptian uh, themed one and here is uh, there is a uh, like some uh, Lego store so we're gonna uh, check it out and then we are going to head to our hotel and it will be the end of the day the cottages uh i like it i don't know i'm gonna switch the you can see how it looks there are one cottage is like two rooms and the theming is nice and i will show you how it looks uh, from the inside when uh, when i uh, when we uh, get there so so yeah, I'm really looking forward to it. And now we are heading to the boutique that is in uh, Legoland uh, village to check out uh, what they have. So finally, some merch for the grown-ups. I don't remember it in the previous years. So there is a nice t-shirt and they have it in multiple colors. 
and also in adult and kids sizes so i like that for sure and the rest uh, here so far looks like mostly toys and i'll show you something interesting if i find anything guys look at this baby yoda keychain oh my god and they also have regular yoda and they didn't uh, have it before so this is so cute and i really love their uh, keychains i am uh, for sure buying uh, baby yoda